today we are at the studio. You can see behind me. I just wanted to give you a sneak peek of what we're doing. It's a lot of everything. And I also wanted to show you that it's not always like fun. <laughs> it's not always like just put together. Look at, there's Chase. Chase is doing all the grunt work today. So right over here is where we put the play set up, monkey head. And look, we've covered, I think, almost all of the poles. So that way they're safe and padded. That way when we run into them, it's not going to hurt. And uh, But it is a mess everywhere, so I want to show you that. Take a look around. This is all the leftover padding. So we're done with that, and this is leftover. So now it's like cleanup day. So much cleanup. We just have tools everywhere, extra netting. Ooh, you're so strong. We have, look, this diner table and chairs out of place. We have tools over there that just made a big mess. We got to clean up. Sneak peek of a project in here. Ooh, oh my Oh my gosh, what's going on? <gasps> no, can't show you. And then just a pile of random stuff that we use for props. We had to take this slat wall off the wall in order to put that slide up over there. I think someone almost died doing it. Yeah. And uh, yeah, like look at this big mess. I'm gonna go see what Stephanie's doing. Take a look in here. Ooh, look at this cool sign. I have the camera on Stephanie. I'm just gonna see what you're doing. Oh. <laughs> She's like, what is going on? Stephanie's putting together like our little, would you call it a bar? Yeah, I mean, I, that's not really work official. I would say more like a break room. Break room. Well, we can just fill it with Red Bull and coffee. Okay, <laughs> coffee bar. Coffee bar. Or buzz bar. It would fit a stool under here, actually. No yeah. How high it is. Actually, yeah, we could put stools in here and skip mm -hmm. the table. But this is where we're going to have like a mini break room, not lounge area. So in the past, we kind of had like our break room and lounge area together, like with a couch, the table chairs, fridge, microwaves going in there. But we don't want to take up any rooms like of the cool map. So we're just going to put our break room back there. We're going to tuck it away. So that way we can heat up our lunch and eat back there. But then it won't take up any rooms for our map for FNAF. And then we'll have a lounge area somewhere else, like where we can chill on the couch. Or you can just chill in the monkey like Logan. Every time we come over here, he just goes and hides in the monkey. All right, so I showed you that. Okay, you know what I'm gonna show you? You saw that big picture, the Five Nights at Freddy's, like at the Megaplex or whatever it's called. I'm gonna show you how we made that because we made it. Maybe we've already shown you this in a previous video. I don't know, they're all blurring together right now because we've been spending every morning, every night here. This is our mega printer. This thing is awesome. We're actually about to print some really cool stuff on this that only this kind of printer can handle. Look, like it's longer than me, I think. If I were to lay down, it's pretty big. This is the office, it's not set up yet. The computer arrives today. Let me ask Chase, actually, because the computer is like really cool. Chase? Yeah. Did the computer come? It hasn't been delivered yet, no. Oh, man, I wanted to show them the computer. Okay, if it comes today later, come back and we can show them. Sounds good. Because you have to set it up. It's a surprise, it's really cool. All right, and then in here, you might have remembered this room was green. I'm gonna let the camera adjust. It's now red, so we had to change it. So this is gonna be Freddy's dressing room. So if you remember the game and you remember his dressing room, leave a comment below with what items you wanna see in Freddy's dressing room. Because maybe this video will go up before our very first security breach. We're putting a bunch of stuff in here. We changed our green trash cans, our dumpsters to blue. So those are gonna be in the game. Fun stuff. And there's gonna be a logo on there. <gasps> what, what? I did not know this. Didn't know what? That you changed the dumpsters to blue. They were a beautiful green. Yeah, but in the game, they're blue. We have to adapt. I hate it here. We have to become better every time. Okay, so they're blue because in the game, they're blue. So Piggy, they were green. FNAF, they're blue. Blue, blue, blue. And then, oh, I don't know if I accidentally gave you a sneak peek of what I'm doing, but this is kind of where I have like all my craft and sewing and making like costume heads and stuff like all there. Some of them I'm just tweaking, making better. Obviously there was a mishap in one of our videos where Freddy here stepped in all the paint. So his costume is now, I think I'm just gonna leave it. If I just leave it, like we all know what happened. He kicked over the distraction paint cans and there was actually paint in it. So he has red feet now. So yeah, that's what's going on. It's like another day at work, another day at the studio and it feels like a mess. It's just like, I'm gonna be here all night. So that's why I have the camera out. Maybe I'll start a little time lapse so you can watch what I do while I'm making costumes. This is my little area right here. I like to have like my pictures out of what I'm making. 
So like here was Freddy. This is the Freddy head that I had on the wall as I was making his head. So cute. Cute. You're so cute. And there were a few mistakes I made, but I learned. So hopefully each head will get better, 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 better. All right, let's go see how I, what I'm doing next. Let's go. I'll bring you back when I do something new. Okay, I finished the armbands for Roxanne and the legs. Now I'm on to do her bracelet. She has like studded bracelets and they're all, I think all the characters look the same. The closest thing I could find without making them from scratch, which I would normally, but with this many characters and costumes to make, I'm just trying to find like the closest match and like the easiest option and what will save me time. So I found this. It's not a perfect match because their studs are spaced a little bit further apart, but whatever. So all I'm gonna do is measure it around here and then attach it and then boom, her forearms are done. And then she has a belt too. We'll get to that later, but I'm just gonna do this first. Okay guys, I just wanna share something with you. I'm doing my costumes and Logan got a new haircut, okay? I'm gonna show you a picture of his haircut. He's like obsessed with his new haircut, right? And he texted me or he FaceTimed me and I'm like, oh, it looks good, blah, blah, blah. I'm like, you remind me of like the young Leonardo DiCaprio or you know, that little boy from Casper. I'm showing my age, but yes, Casper the friendly ghost. And I send him a picture and then he's like, how? And I'm like, oh, your hair. We call it M hair, like makes a little M, right? He sends me a text back, so rude, and it's like, well, this is you, mom. And give the camera a second to adjust. What is that? Seriously, Logan? That is so rude. My tongue is not even green. Rude. Okay, guys, I have a little confession to make. I tried to take a shortcut and order some costumes to kind of help me out, save on time, because we're slammed. And uh, let me just show you. We ordered Freddy. This is Glamrock Freddy. When it came, like I wasn't too happy with it because it's really tiny and like it hurts your head. Like it is so, so tiny and tight. Like, and Noob Dad has a really big head. Let's face it, like he needed a bigger mask. So I had to make this Glamrock Freddy. So here they are side by side. This is my confession. I tried to cheat. So here's the one that I ordered this guy, but it just, it won't fit our heads. Even my head, my head's not as big as theirs. So I had to make this Glamrock Freddy. Hello. Well, the same with a few of the other masks, not all of them, but a few. When they came, I think I'm too OCD or really picky because I didn't really like the shape of uh, Monty's head because it came up like really high, like he had like a cone head. So I ripped it open and I took um, all the fluff out so I could maybe shape it a little better. I'm still not loving the shape, but here's the thing guys. We have on our schedule to film in two days and I need all of these animatronics. So I think what we're gonna do is we're just gonna, I'm just gonna have to like sew him back up and we're just gonna have to use all of them as is. We're just gonna have to shove our heads in there. I'm actually gonna have to cut an opening so our heads will fit and we'll use them as is and then um, in the future, I'll just start making all the other heads because yeah, I'm really picky on the heads and how they look. I want them to look really close to the game. If you have any tips or tricks, uh, leave a comment below to help me out because uh, I'm running low on time here and it's just me and I need help. But Glamrock Freddy's done. Hiya. Isn't he so cute? He's so handsome. Anyways, yeah. Oh, actually, you know what? Everybody tell Chase what a great job he did. Chase made the earring. I told him what I needed for the earring and he came back in the room with this and it is so perfect. Good job, noob dad. Okay, I had to show you guys what Stephanie's doing. <laughs> she's using the kid's scooter. <laughs> Don't tell them. <laughs> no, she's actually really strong. She can lift up that big box. <laughs> Those are the scooters that the kids use to like slide down the slides. Where are all the scooters? Stephanie took them. Yeah, she did. Bye. All right, I'm distracted. Oh, I gotta show you something else. First, let me censor her. 
Okay guys, look, I'm using, her name is Tammy, but I just told Stephanie, I think I wanna rename her to Sheila. So I think I'm gonna call her Sheila. So Sheila here is my little model mannequin. Look, I even gave her a skirt. Leftover Friday material. Okay, so normally I use the kids. I have the kids just stand in place and then I measure them and then I put the foam on them, but they're not here and I need to get this done. So I'm gonna use Sheila. Everyone say hello to her. She's doing such a great job. Let's see how long she can keep her arms up like that. Perfect model. She's so good. Guys, I'm here making Monty's costume and I look over, <laughs> look at her. This is what we do at the studio. We crawl around playing with scooters. <laughs> her kids are probably jealous. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm done with Monty. Well, I'm almost done. All right, I have the top part of the vest. I'm gonna try it on real quick. I did put a zipper on it. Oh, I am wearing a hoodie, so. Yeah, it's not gonna lay flat on my shoulders. Zippy doo dah. Zipper right there. Nice. And then the bottom part of his, I just put it in, let's say, an inch to half an inch. Is that gonna be enough? Yeah. Then I add his chest, his belly. Is this the last? Oh, and then I gotta add his bottoms. Oh, and his tail. Okay. okay, not close to done with Monty, but I mean, I got a lot done. These are so much fun to put on and off. Like, woo! Normally we have like a helper. Back to the floor. guys, I am taking a break from Roxy's costume. I'm gonna show you in a second because I've gotten a lot done. But I wanted to show you, Stephanie painted these trash cans blue. They used to be green. And she just put the decals on there, which I'm gonna glue them on. But I'm also gonna dirty them up. So I just wanted to bring you along, show you what I'm doing. Stephanie! Stephanie, will you print me another one? Oops. Can you hear me? Stephanie, can you hear me? Yeah. Actually, change of plans. Let's go tell her what happened. I thought I heard you call my name. Oh my gosh! Jump scare. What is supposed okay. to happen? Um, I need a new paper. Okay. You I might have heard you, and I was like, um. Uh. Oh my gosh! I don't know if it's because I was walking through this security room and I was like getting the feels of I being scared. Oh my gosh! We brought me too because the other one's probably yeah. gonna rip. Oh my gosh! She's scared the out of me. All right guys, I'm back. Got them printed, new ones. I don't know if this is gonna hold that well because I'm just using a glue stick and glue stick, it's not long lasting, honestly. I used to make a lot of crafts for the kids' teachers when they were younger. And like the next year, all the glue stick projects would be falling off the wall. But maybe it'll hold long enough for this series, right? Look, it's already curling off. Ah! I should have sprayed it, but I didn't want to inhale. It's okay if it looks wrinkly. So now what I'm doing is, oh my, oh! <gasps> Paper towel fell. I have paint, my paint palette. It's just black. And I have a paper towel, which now I have black paint on it, so I should have worn gloves. I didn't get to plan where this went, but we're just gonna make it dirty looking. Come follow me as we craft. I have finished with the trash can. It looks so good and dirty. Ooh. Look, we have dumpster rolls. And caution, do not play in, on, or around, or occupy this container. Yeah, we know we're gonna be playing in that trash can. I gotta show you guys something. Oh, big boy printers at work. Wow, look at that. Done! So big. Look how big this is. Okay, this is incredible. All right guys, I am wrapping up this vlog. I'm not completely done with the costumes. I'm really, really close. But in another vlog, actually comment down below if you wanna see me do another vlog and I'll show you the complete costumes with like the tail and everything for Monty. There's his chest plate. 
Here is Araxe, and uh, look over at this room so far. Look, a little bit more has been done. There's Freddy's vanity, and we already have the border. It's in the other room. I just wanna wrap it up because, I mean, I feel like this is a really long vlog because, honestly, we've been doing so much lately. So much, costumes are almost done. But the video just came out where we put this playset together, and I asked you in that video to comment down below if you knew where these were from and uh, I would pin that comment. I haven't pinned a comment yet because nobody has said it, but hopefully by the time this video comes out, I will have pinned a comment. Look, can you even see it from this angle? I don't know. Okay guys, my battery died on my camera right there. See, I knew I was vlogging too long, but I wanted to tell you guys what this is from, what this is. This is from McDonald's. I remember having my fifth birthday party at McDonald's. <laughs> It's back when it was a cool place to have your birthday party. Like, it was really fun. Fun memories. But this thing is a fish sandwich. See? It's not a hamburger. There's no there's no sesame seeds on the bun. It's fish sandwich. Because look, you see the tail? Come here, little fishy. A fish sandwich toy from McDonald's. It used to be outside. They used to have a lot of fun, dangerous toys out there, but they're all gone now. <laughs> I don't know what the blue one is. I don't remember his name. If you know that one, leave a comment. And before we end the vlog officially, I'm gonna go see what Stephanie is doing, wrapping it up for the end of the day. Stephanie, I'm here. Hi. Showing them. Oh, look at this. We have four of these big things printed. There's Monty, Roxy. Ooh, Chick is so cute. And I already showed you Freddy. We'll show you, I'll pull them out later in another vlog. And then look at this. See that? Do you know where that goes in the map? Oh, and then I said we did the border. We printed the border for Freddy's room. Stephanie printed it. I say we, but Stephanie did all the work right there. Hey, good job, Stephanie, in the comments. <laughs> That is it for the end of the day. Hope you guys enjoyed a little behind the scenes of what we're doing at the studio. Getting uh, Five Nights at Freddy's ready. And uh, it was a mess, but it's coming together. This is day two of cleaning the mess. And the costumes, I'm probably gonna have to fall into day three of finishing the costumes. So if you wanna see uh, the final details on those costumes, leave a comment and maybe we'll do another vlog of wrapping it up and then playing. Fun oh. off.